Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm the Marmoset. This is a five-minute burst of FTL, and I am very pleased to accept your surrender. What's on fire? The med bay. The med bay is already on fire, and I'm already evacuating it. Um, my hull is critical. I got their surrender. I got fuel. I got a drone part, some miniature on that. But we are still, however, taking a little bit of a beating. So, come on. Yes, jump. Why? I don't want to be here anymore. <laughs> Why the stress over the store? Because you have a half distant chance to see what you can get down here. Service to investigate. A lone survivor. I would like crew. Yay, a shield expert. Well, that's exactly what I want. You have to stay in the cockpit for a bit, because the room next door is on fire, hideously. Come on, run out of there. Run out of there, thank you. Um, close the doors. Go and fix. Yes, you'll take a little bit of O2 problems in a bit, but in a few moments, the door will be fixed. Turn that on. You, my lovely friend. The bubbly noise is made from the healing. Everyone heals up, heals up. You, you should be there. So yeah, we've got a guy who's already good with shields to go in our spare shield slot. So that distress jump worked out really well. Let's see what's in the shop. The most immediate answer to what's in the shop is going to be things with which you can patch our hull back up with. So... Fix all. There goes almost all of our scrap. <laughs> Done. So, what else have we got here that will be nice? Um, we don't have anything to sell. I really like the Medi-Gel Dispersal Death. That will get us up to 49, which is enough to buy anything particularly we right. have only got a couple of missiles. Chain lasers, they can be quite half decent. Um, you can get these ones, yeah, they fire quite quickly after a while. So they're really good for long battles. The best one, of course, being the Vulcan, which just chews through everything. I love doing it. it when I'm wins on easy, I just go up against the final boss, point the Vulcan at their shields, and then just go and wander off and have a cup of tea. As long as you, you can just manage your own ship then and just let the Vulcan do all the damage. So, we don't have anything much else here. I mean, hull repair is a really nice one to have. You don't mind spending the drone parts for basically free shields. But, um, yeah, there's a half decent selection of weapons there, but I think what we will probably be investing, investing the remainder of our scrap in is saving it. Um, we've got 16 drones. We're not in any danger of running out of time soon. We've got 20 fuel, and we're not using any missile weapons. So thank you, little shop shop, for being on our repair station. So we're going to go around the top, because we can. I think we've got the time. Our crew is healing up nicely, thanks to the power of nanotechnology. No one wants to talk to me here. Well, there's a store up there, but we're not going there just yet. Why? Because there'll be no point. We don't have any scrap. Aid the Federation ship. Why? We are a Federation ship, and we are a good people. So, power up, power up. Nope, turn that off. Power that up. Target with this, the guns. So we've got a multi-firing laser and a beam weapon. So that multi-fire is probably going to get through our shields and cause us some problems. Or not. Exceptionally good shooting. <laughs> that worked out really, really well. So now we just have to wait for the timings to swing around. And hopefully we won't get too many misses. But um, hmm. keeping that stunned is nice. But I think that's going to hurt. Yeah, okay. Um, guy on the engines fixed that. Might have to... S yeah, okay, we're in a bit of trouble here. We're going to get shields down and get lasered in a second. There we go. Shields down and get lasered. Fortunately, no one was too badly hurt. That's back up. Auto fire on. But I'm going to try and see if I can time this. Hmm. I don't want to be on fire. Evacuate that. This might be a, quite a tricky run to do with. Um, come on. Disengage, re-engage. Let's see if we can get this time. I want their shields down and then you firing. Yes! Right. Um, I think my tactics of focusing on these things has been vaguely successful, but now that's damaged. Keeping their shields down and actually doing more damage with the drone is of more use to me right now. Yeah, you can have your laser weapon. Absolutely fine with you having a laser weapon. I want those shields down. Yeah, the earlier choice of trying to null their weapons is useful because you're trying what to do is basically reduce the amount of damage they can lay out on you. But it wasn't working because I simply wasn't doing enough damage. Um, so they're around longer and stand more chance of getting shots down. Whereas if I'm killing their guns, we get the nice kind of explosions like that. So let's contact the Federation ship. 
Virgis Rax and Lysander Fanny Gregory pump their ship with nanobots to aid the rescue. Yay! Danko ship. Medbots help stabilize the but most perish. Oh, so we've got another shields guy. Okay, so we've got shed load of fuel, nice bit of scrap, and another crew member. I always like rock people. Um, I'm always a big fan of the rock people. Uh, I will put you for now on cameras. You may end up finding yourself shuttling onto that when we get problems at various points. So let's get that all healed up. Let's push the button that puts them in place. And that's our five minute burst for today. Thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. We took a little bit of a pasting. I've had to change tactics. Um, the important thing is I've learnt that I need to just keep their shields down and let the drone do its work rather than trying to suppress their guns. I just end up with the synchrosing all wrong and it just doesn't work out in the end. So let's see where we get next time. Please remember to like and subscribe.